Hey folks, my name is Ravish and welcome back to another video on my channel Logic Ops Lab. Now, there is a very huge announcement and today I'm going to tell you how you can win one certification free of cost from Microsoft to give any sort of exam that is uh, that is there. And there is a challenge that is going on. I'm going to talk about the challenge. I'm going to guide you step by step how you can register, how you can complete the exam. So it has been going since uh, last 10, 20 days, but there are still 10 days to cover it and you can easily cover the exam you can as easily study about it and you still have uh, 10 days you can sit around uh, on a weekend for uh, five four five hours and then you can complete it or you can do one one to two hours daily and you can complete with, within 10 days you will get a free certification microsoft totally free of cost and people who are students uh, people who are in uh, colleges and do not do not have enough money for a certification this is 165 dollar exam and you are getting it for free so in this video we are going to talk about rules and regulation of that what kind of exams are available what kind of exam you can take and then you can go ahead in your devops certification journey or microsoft certification journey all right so we're going to do everything step by step so do not worry stay till the end of the video and see how am i doing it and then you can do the same all right so uh, again, uh, I would like to request that if you're new over here and seeing me for the first time, my name is Ravish and I create content for DevOps and cloud related stuff. I also make announcement like this. So that would be very much beneficial for you. Hit the like button, subscribe to my channel and because it really motivates me to create more content like this. So without further ado, let's get started. So as you can see on my screen, I'll be putting this link uh, in my description. You can just click on that and went through it. Uh, so this is Microsoft Ignite Edition Challenge. And in that, uh, let's talk about the official rules. So these are the terms and condition. Challenge detail is Microsoft Learn Cloud Skills Challenge starts from October 12th. So we are like kind of 10, uh, 10 20 days uh, uh, late, but uh, not worry about it. We still have uh, a few days, which is November 9, which is close to 10 days and 10 days are enough for reading and just after that you just have to get the voucher and book it and after that you can take the exam let's talk about that so this is in utc okay so utc let's see what's the utc time right now let me refresh this it's 4 22 pm and the time right now is 9 52 so i think there is around six seven hours of difference all right so after that what you have to do you are required to provide an email address during registration for the microsoft learn cloud skills challenge you will be contacted via the email address now the good thing is to create an account with uh, live.com, live.in, outlook.com, hotmail.com. That's a good thing. But if you have a Gmail, then also it's fine. But uh, if you have uh, the one that Microsoft provided, then th that would be really great. So uh, by completing one challenge within the Microsoft Learn Cloud Challenge, eligible individuals are entitled to one free Microsoft certification exam. And that's, that's free of cost. Okay, so let's talk about the offer details. So offer details says you can only claim one offer per person so one offer per person regardless the number of challenges you complete so even if you complete 10 challenges all the challenges you will get only one voucher prior to redeeming your free certification exam let me expand it a bit government employees must check with their employers to ensure that participation is permitted so if you i think uh, if you're not uh, if you're a student or just someone who's looking looking for a private job you don't have to uh, worry about this but if you're a government employee and still looking for this then i think this is for you Third point is this exam may offer may be redeemed to take one Microsoft exam delivered at an authorized Pearson View Testing Center. So Pearson View Testing Center is uh, like um, kind of a center in which you can go and take the exam. Like you go for your board's exam, like you uh, go for your university exams and kind. There are uh, certain uh, Microsoft certified centers. You can go there, take the exam and come out with free certification. Okay. So this exam offer is only redeemable for selected Microsoft exam. While you can take any of the select eligible exam, please see the challenge that aligns with each exam. Okay, so these are the eligible exam. So AZ305 is designing Microsoft infrastructure solutions. Uh, let, let us check, check that out. So this is the one you can go through it. So passing score for every, every, every exam is 700 and the total score is 1000. Okay, so these are the guides and you can go through it see the original cost is 165 dollars and you are getting it for free okay that's that's really good okay uh let's go to uh another one which is az 400 dp 100 mb 240 this and this and all of them so if i read it one two three four five six seven eight there are total eight exams over here 
if you are a devops engineer uh, i would really ask you to go through two of them uh, this is the one designing microsoft azure infrastructure solutions and this is uh, one challenge and the other one is az400 uh, i did it two years back so i'll be doing it again to renew my so let's do it right now because even i have not also done it so let's do it right away okay so i'm gonna click it uh, i'll do this one so you can do for anything i'll do for this let's open it and aligning challenge is this so I'll let me just right click on this and open let it open so let's see what az400 is designing and implementing microsoft solution microsoft devops solution i'm already certified on this but uh, i'll be doing it again because i think it has expired like uh, last month i guess uh, i did it in uh, 2020 so parts of the uh, microsoft certified devops engineer expert so uh, you will be getting this one and uh, uh, you can easily uh, copy it and show it on your LinkedIn. That would be really much, uh, really, really beneficial for you. And you can put it on your resume as well. All right. So exam this, uh, the cost is again, 165 USD, which is I think close to 10, 10,000 rupees. And you can schedule the exam through uh, Pearson view. Okay. So uh, let's go to challenge this and it is asking for uh, join the challenge. So you can see 10 days, zero hours, 33 minutes. So I think 10 days is just good enough to complete the course, at least complete the challenge. And you can sit on a weekend, sit on uh, and go through everything or just give two to three hours on every day. If you're a student, then it would be much more beneficial for you. And if you're working and you uh, are looking for a certification, so let's join the challenge. I'll click over here. Let's see what happens. It's looking for an email ID. So if you do not have an email ID, uh, then I think you should uh, create one. And if you already have, I already have. So I'll just type it ravishravat at tradelive.com. You can create on live. You can create on Outlook. You can create on Hotmail. You can create on live.in and these will be all eligible okay let's click on next and uh, because i'm doing it from incognito it has sent me a verification code for my email id okay so uh, i'll just put my email id over here and uh, i'll just fast forward that. okay so i have given that stay signed in let's do that Okay, agree to terms to enroll in the Microsoft Ignite Cloud Developer Challenge. Yes, let's agree to this. Uh, if you want to see the official rules, click on this and you can go through the official rules. And these are the terms and conditions which we already know. Okay, let's go back and click on continue. Okay, start learning. I think there is a leaderboard thing. Uh, you can click on that and see if everything is fine. Okay, so there are 29,032 participants as of now on 30th October, 10 p.m. Indian Standard Time. So you have to register, start learning. Okay, so this is the one. So introduction to DevOps, choose the right path, describe team structures, choose the DevOps tools, plan agile with GitHub projects, project introduction to source control, describe types of source control, working with Azure, and these are everything. So you have to just complete all of them within 10 days and you can easily win the certification voucher. Okay, how to do that? Let me click on this introduction to DevOps. Let's go over here. Okay, so here is a module. It has seven units, as you can see on my screen, 21 minutes, uh, and people has rated something like that. Okay. So this module explores the key areas that organization must, must apply to start their DevOps transformation journey, change the team's mindset and define the goals. So you can start it. So there are multiple things over here and there is a knowledge check as well, which is a quiz. Let's do one of them. So this is something like this. DevOps is a union of this and this. So hundred XP is the point. So these points get added to your account. Uh, right now my account is, uh, I've done a lot of certifications from this, so uh, do not mind that. I have it and you have to go through it, everything. So four minutes read kind of thing. And then you have to go through it. Uh, what exactly is the area, this and that. Prerequisite, this and that, this and that. And you can just continue over here. Once understood, what exactly is this? So you can see this diagram, very beautiful diagram over here. Understand the cycle time, this and this. Read everything, do not just scroll over, read everything i'm just showing it to you because i want to sh show you like how it's done and then continue and then there are a lot of things available over here see how good it looks to do in progress this is uh, a planning board okay and you will learn about uh, agile you will learn about kanban and a lot of other things okay and multiple things continue and uh, it's talking about the two minutes read read everything okay do not do not just skip it read everything continue and then there is an option check your knowledge okay so which of the following choices best describe devops so devops is the role of who manages source control pipelines and monitor environments to continue devops is the union of people processes and this devops is a new process and creating continuous delivery so which of this is correct 
So DevOps is the role who manages source control pipelines and monitor environments to continue delivering the value of the software project. Okay. And DevOps is the, so let's select anything and not, uh, I'm not reading much about it and see what happens. Okay. So I'm selecting this DevOps, the union of people, processes and products to enable continuous delivery and value to our end users. And then which of this following choices drive an ongoing merging and testing of code leads to finally, uh, leads to finding facts early. Uh, what do you do? So let's say continuous feedback. I'm not sure whether it's correct or not. Which of these following is the choice practice that enables the automatic creation of environments? How do you automate create? Let's select infrastructure as a code and you can check your answer there in that. Let's see. So I've got the 400 points uh, because uh, let's review the answer. Okay. So my first answer was correct. My second answer was wrong because continuous integration was the right answer and infrastructure as a code was the right answer, which was perfect, but this was the correct. So I intentionally selected continuous feedback so that you can at least for the next time you can correct it. Once you continue it, unlock achievement. Let's see what happens. And you can see that uh, it's done. So let's click on continue. And then you can see, let's go over here. Let's go over here. And this leaderboard gets uh, updated like every 24 hours. So do not worry about that. And I'll just, uh, we were over here, right? Introduction to DevOps. Let me again click over it. And you can see this 800 XP I have got because I have completed this module. You can see right, 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 right over here. Previously it was no right. Okay. Do not do like the way I did because I just went forward and did it to show you how it's done. In order to pass the certification, you need the knowledge. So do not do that. Okay. Uh, the way. So after that, what do you have to do? Just go back. Uh, let me just close this leaderboard. Go back over here. Go back again over here and see uh, introduction to DevOps. This is done, right? Then go back over here. Next is choose the right project and then start doing the same thing. All right. So once you've done done it, you will get a, a voucher or your email ID will automatically be clubbed with a voucher and you can take the exam. All right. So this is one chance to get a certification for free of cost. All right. So uh, again, if you have any question, feel free to comment below because this is for limited time for like 10, 10 more days are there. And please, please, please do that. If you have any kind of confusion, I have a telegram group, please join that. I always answer to the questions that are written below. Then I will be getting back to you in no time. All right. So I wish you all the very best. And again, I would like to request that if you're new over here and seeing me for the first time, please subscribe to the channel because to stay updated with these kind of things for free certification and a lot of other cloud and DevOps related stuff. And uh, yeah, so have a great day, all the best. And uh, I would like to see you in the next one.